Ellen Lee DeGeneres is an American comedian, television host, actress, writer, and producer. She starred in the sitcom Ellen from 1994 to 1998 and has hosted her syndicated television talk show, The Ellen DeGeneres Show, since 2003. She was born on January 26, 1958 in Metairie, Louisiana to Elizabeth Jane, a speech therapist, and Elliot Everett DeGeneres, an insurance agent. She has one brother, Vance, a musician and producer, and he was born on September 2, 1954, a little over three years before Ellen's birth. Of French, English, German, and Irish descent, she was raised a Christian scientist. Her parents filed for separation in 1973 and were divorced the following year. Shortly after, Ellen's mother married Roy Grusendorf, a salesman. Betty Jane and Ellen moved with Grusendorf from New Orleans area to Atlanta, Texas. Vance stayed with his father. In 1997, DeGeneres came out as a lesbian. The disclosure of her sexual orientation sparked intense interest by American tabloids. The conscientiousness of the media coverage stunted her professional career and left her mild in depression. Yet I was getting letters from kids that almost committed suicide but didn't because of what I did. And I realized that I had a purpose and it wasn't just about me and it wasn't about celebrity but in her book love ellen degeneres mother betty describes being initially shocked when degeneres came out but she has since become one of her strongest supporters she is also an active member of p flag and spokesperson for the human rights campaign coming out project the same year she came out, DeGeneres started a romantic relationship with actress Anne Hesch that lasted until August of 2000. From 2000 to 2004, DeGeneres maintained a close affair with photographer Alexandra Hedison. The couple appeared on the cover of The Advocate after their separation had already been announced to the media. Since 2004, DeGeneres has had a relationship with Portia DeRozzi. After the overturn of the same-sex marriage ban in California, DeGeneres and DeRozzi were engaged and married in August of 2008 at their home in Beverly Hills, California. The passage of Proposition 8 cast doubt on the legal status of their marriage, but a subsequent California Supreme Court judgment validated it because it occurred before November 4, 2008. In August 6 of 2010, DeRozzi filed for a petition to legally change her name to Portia Lee James DeGeneres. The petition was granted, and on September 23, 2010, Portia DeRozzi is a retired actress and current businesswoman. She runs her own art company, General Public, where they utilize Sinograph, a 3D technology developed by DeRozzi alongside Fujifilm. In early 2018, DeGeneres revealed that her father, Elliot Everett DeGeneres, has passed away at 92 years old. She wrote in a tweet that the passing was not unexpected and that she was able to say goodbye. He was 92 years old, she said in the video. He had a good long life, and he lived his life exactly how he wanted. He was a Christian scientist early in his life, and he never had medicine his whole life. He never went to a doctor. He never had a vaccination. We never had medicine growing up, and he lived to be 92. He was very proud of me, she said. He loved the show. He was a kind man, a very accepting man. There was not a bone of judgment in his body. Though DeGeneres does not have any children and does not plan on having any, she does have a lot of pets and is an avid animal lover. She and her wife, Portia DeRozzi, have seven pets. They have four dogs, Wolf, Augie, Kid, and Willis, and they also have three cats named Charlie, George, and Chairman. Ellen told people that she used to dream of becoming a veterinarian when she grew up. So now she has a passion for rescuing animals. The most recent addition to the family, Wallace, is a purebred poodle that the couple adopted. Ellen also has her own wildlife fund, the Ellen DeGeneres Wildlife Fund, and has partnered with Prince Harry on a project for elephants without borders. And if you like this video, then make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos in the future. Let us know in the comment section below if you have any suggestions for our future videos, and we'll see you in the next video.